Here's another brand that's not been around very much. I see these in dribs and drabs still, but they used to be um, all over the place and they've just sort of fallen away. Um, and the reason why I pick them up every now and again, if I can find them at the right price, is because I've had two or three of these guitars that were actually really, really good. Um, this is Spectrum, and I've talked about them again early on in the channel history. I may have had one or two models. This is the Spectrum AIL265AE for Acoustic Electric. It is the auditorium cutaway model or concert cutaway model. Spruce top, sapelli back and sides, in-house electronics, all the usual accoutrements. There's the headstock there with the rather faint Spectrum logo. Uh, again, very competent, nice rosewood board. Uh, nice southwestern style rosette on that. Black binding with purfling all the way around. Uh, just, you know, one of their own preamps in it, but it's sufficient. Uh, Nine volt powered. Um, yeah, and you can see some nice green on this. Again, it is a ply top. Two ply top, but it's uh, you know very decent. Nice voice on this. Um, nice and bright, uh, but not too nasally. Uh, it's just got a nice, a nice articulate voice for the price range. Uh, I just went across this and picked it up. Again, I don't see large distribution of these. I think they might have been uh, an Amazon brand for a while um, because I saw them um, sold quite a bit in uh, maybe three or four years ago in large quantities. But they seem to have died back and you run across them every once in a while. Um, the sellers that sell them only seem to sell one or two. I did run across an eBay seller a couple of years ago now um, that was selling that had some affiliation with Spectrum and was selling off some um, floor models from their factory showroom um, and I bought a few off of him and I was really impressed but that dried up and I suspect maybe these guys are no more you're just seeing the last dregs uh, of their um, stock uh, still being sold off on the market along with some used ones as well. But I don't see any evidence of uh, any, any more production. Um, and that happens a lot with these size companies. If anyone knows about Spectrum, um, let me know in the comments below the video. But this, like the other Spectrums, is very decent. I did have to do some setup on this. It had a ba bad back bow uh, and some pretty bad fret sprout. And it had all the hallmarks uh, of a guitar that's been sitting in a warehouse a long time that got dried out. And uh, I suspect that, um, you know, uh, a lot of these Spectrum guitars were, were in that situation. Um, they were just being sold out of a warehouse. Uh, they were selling off their stock and basically folding up. That's, that's what I suspect from the evidence. It might not tr be true we might see a, a resurgence of these. But judging from the last few I've had, it seems like, um, you know, um, they were just selling off warehouse stock and they're not doing any more of these. So um, let me know if you know anything, but they are very, very decent. And I've had some really nice Spectrum Electrics as well um, over the last couple of years. Again, I find them uh, here and there, um, being the new ones, I mean, that are being sold uh, in twos and threes by certain sellers. So I don't think there's a lot of them floating around, but they, they're not bad. They're decently made. Uh, again, they tend to need uh, some setup. Uh, the ones I've had tend to be rather dried out. The fretboards are like white and you have to oil them. Um, a lot of times there, there's a, a, a forward or back bow on the neck. It just seems like it's, they've been sitting around in in certain warehouse conditions for a while, but um, I've had good luck when I find them and occasionally you see people selling them rather cheap. And I think they're cut above, you know, the Glarys and the uh, Rogues 
uh, of the world. I think they're slightly better materials um, than that. So um, I think they're well worth it for sort of the entry level market. So there you go, folks. This is a Spectrum AIL 265AE. Um, nice little concert cutaway. Uh, I think it's a 38 inch uh, length on this, so this is about the size of a classical guitar with a cutaway. Um, nice guitar, nice spruce on the top. I like the, uh, the rosette, I like the, the look of this guitar, it's, it's very nice. So I thought I'd show it to you. Alright folks, see you on the next one.